Okay. So, I have decided what kind of session I'm going to run today. So, we'll just freestyle it. Let me know if I'm not in view. I think I am. So, we're just going to start with the shoulders back. We might do a little bit more abdominal as well today. Nice sumo squat. And the three, the four, at least the sunshine's back. Five, six, six more. Five, I feel a bit tired today. Four, three, two, and one. And then just pull back. Shoulders feel tired. I seem to have done loads of weights this week. Two and one, and then really wide, wide leg, chin to chest, hips back, just gently fold down just to mobilize the spine. Nice warm up. Letting the head just hang towards the floor. Take a little rock forwards and backwards. And then walk both hands to one foot and then to the other foot. So just to warm up really, the hand is not particularly stretched, just side to side. One more each side. And then back to centre, start bringing the feet back in so they rest underneath the hip, gently up. And we'll just do 12 calf raises to get the calves ready for one, which you know is two, three, four. This is a bit cooler, isn't it? Six, six more, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And then just four big circles, two in one direction. Two in the other, and the other way. And two. I keep getting this little flicker with my eye. It's really doing my head, and I don't know what that is. Very weird. Like, do you know, like a pulsing? Anyway, <laughs> come to the edge of your mat. I'll just move my thing a bit that way. That's it. So chin to chest. Gently down, really slow. Take the hips back, the weight forwards. Oh, everything. We did a really hard session on Monday night in Pilates, like a strength session. And my legs are hurting. That's what, oh, you were there, Karen. That's what Liz said yesterday. Her legs were killing. Hold into that plank position. Either take the knee down and then have a swivel into a half plank, lifting up the waist. Working through the side muscles, back and then the other side, or full plank if you're familiar with it. Hold. Back to centre, knees down, elbows back, chest and chin to ground, reach up into upward dog, take a breath in. Back into plank. Back into a downward dog, sending the heels towards the floor, having a little bounce. Walk the hands back. And then gently up. And we will do that one more time. So chin to chest, hips back, weight forwards. Gently down. Have a little rock forward and back. Walking out. Full plank position. Push the mat away. Rotate your shoulders a little bit so you're broadening the upper trapezius muscles. They're not scrimping together like that. Hold. Again, I bring the nose, the nose, sorry. Bring the knee down. I just have a swivel. Lift up that bottom waist. Nice, strong oblique muscles, back to centre, the other way, lift, back and then either knees down or you can try 
chaturanga like this. God, I that were hard today. <laughs> I told you my shoulders feel tightly. Tuck. Take the hips nice and high. Walk the hands back a little bit more this time. Just take the right heel down. The left. The right. The left. The right. The left. The right. Take the left leg up. Have a little rotation as you take that heel towards the opposite butt cheek to open up the hip a little bit. And the other way. And then gently down, walk it back. Woo! And all nice and warm. Brilliant. Okay, let's get started. We'll finish dead on 10, guys, so I've got to pick my mother up. My lovely mother. Okay, I do love her, really. So we're just going to come down, and we're just going to come in to those ins and outs. Three, two, one. If at home anyone's watching on YouTube and you can't do the jumping, just take it side to side. Sometimes if your pelvic floor's not the greatest. dead words today. <laughs> Step touch. <clears throat> okay, next one we're going to do um, star jump. God, I'm sounding like Joe Wicks. Huh? <gasps> okay, star jumps, two star jumps and a tuck. Oh, I'll jump forward if you don't want to tuck. Three, two, one. One, two, one.
with Karen, wouldn't you now? Liz came in last night when you've broken me. Okay, good work. We're going to come down after each two lots of three. We're going to do abdominal work and then back up. That's my excuse. <laughs> so, when you come down, we're going to try and target the lower belly if we can. So bring both legs into tabletop, but push the lower back into the mat today. We're not doing it in neutral. Cough, and when you cough, feel that contraction and try and hold it. Does that make sense? So just relax and cough again. And then hold that contraction, lift up, keep the ribs down and just lower the legs without letting the belly go. Lower the legs. Very hard to keep that lower back pushed in. Really keep the lower back pushed in. You don't have to go super low, guys. You want to still watch that tipping forward. Lower, push the lower back in. If it bothers your neck. Take the hand, the head back down. Push in. My studio is boiling, guys, at the minute. And then hold, just lift up if you're not already lifted. Take the shoulder blades away, straighten the legs. Hold for 30. Chin to chest, ribcage closed, lower back on the mat. Ten. And give yourself a little hug into chest. And then take the legs up nice and high, hands behind your head, push the lower back in again, see if you can do double legs high, if not, take it back into tabletop, so push the ribcage down, down, back up, keep the cards high, you will feel like you're tipping a bit, so push that lower back into the mat, double legs, you have to be very disciplined with this one. Yeah, rib cage down. Works the deeper abdominal muscles. I don't often teach it, but you guys are pretty good. Push lower back into mat. Five. running off me today. Two. Hold it. Lift up. Oh, I'm going to have to go like that. My hip flexors are kicking in then. Lift a bit higher. Push the mat in, back into the mat again. And relax. Just take it into a Butterfly pose. Beautiful. One more set of abdominals. Take your hands backward into star, chin to chest, ribs down, navel to spine, lift. Same side, lower, two. Click, click, 
pulling. Good. And then just these ones. So be careful with the neck, chin to chest, and just take right hand towards the right outer calf for three. The neck's in a good position, it should be fine. You can always hold to give it a little bit more protection. Eight more. Switch, 16. Four, three, two, and one. Oh, well done. Again, just side to side. And then just come, just stick your bum up, take a breath in, round, did do a lot of abs last night, and then gently back, and up, around tour, okay, so we're going to do, it's not the ski season, but we're going to do mogul feel, so just side to side, keep with that little hip movement, so work in the waist, so you can No. <laughs> okay, to my mind up. to the lakeside for half ten. So if anyone fancies it, how would they list it? Okay, let's go again. Three, two, one. And I think it's supposed to be a nice day. Try and swivel. Push yourself, guys. 
guys. You can do all high knees. I'm not. Because, you know, I'm shattered. <laughs> okay, three, two, one. just no jumps. Three, two, one, I'll follow me and do both. One without, one with.
neck nice and long. Well done, guys. Okay. Right, brilliant. Okay, let's come up into our plank. Chin to chest. Make sure the neck's nice and long. Bring it in and under. In, under. Really work on them deep, 
glute muscles today. round, reach the top over the bottom. The other side. to center just do two counter cat two rolling cat rolling the other way And then come to lie on your tummy. Bring that right, uh, left heel to butt. My quads are tight today. Push the pubic bone down, hold the stretch. Go to the other side. Push the pubic bone down. Beautiful. Come and lie. <laughs> I feel like I'm literally a sweaty mess this morning. Take your arms up. Chin to chest. Protract, retract. Protract, retract. Protract, retract. Retract, retract. Hands together, not together, facing each other. Go easy, close your eyes. Into helicopter. Yes, so scissor, circle. We'll move a little bit, guys. Good, take one hand underneath and just pull it into deltoid. And the other way. And then just take your elbows out just into puppet. Keep everything moving. And then arms down by your side. 
palms up to your shoulders, palms turn up to ceiling, over and then back round and again. And then just create that length through your collarbones. Just take a right ear to shoulder, that to centre, left ear, that to centre, all on each side. I did quite a lot of overhead yesterday, you know where you take the weight up above your head and then bring it down towards your hip as you lift your knee. I can really feel my neck today. So just take chin gently to ceiling and then more importantly to your chest. And then again, almost like you're drawing it in with the whole chin. And again. Good, well done. And then just lengthen one leg, take the other leg to tabletop and just bring it across the body. We've done quite a bit of oblique work, so you might really feel this stretch around your SI area. slowly back just into glute stretch just to push just in case any of that discomfort's coming from the bum well done and as always just into hamstring so and calves so just flex the foot just hold and the foot in and out in and out, in and out, and then just gently down, other side, just notice if there's any difference, there is for me, this side not much of a stretch at all, the other one was quite a lot today, and then again, flex, Hold. And then in and out, in and out. And then just into glute, push the knee away. And then take your arms backwards. Take a beautiful, big, deep breath in. And out breath as we gently come up, reaching forwards, hold that hamstring stretch. Settle your shoulders. gently come into a shin box uh, so one foot goes into the front knee shoulders down lift yourself up place your hands on the floor foot down and gently come up to standing 